Hey, no, no, what are you making today? Banana cake. Oh, banana bread? Yeah, bread. Oh, I my. call them a cake. Is it cake or bread? I think it's the same thing, no? Well, I call them a cake anyway. It's so good. Banana cake's my favorite. Yeah, but that's your mother's uh, good recipe. Her recipe? I just came to help. Okay, let's see how you do it. Okay. We're going to chop this walnut. Hey mom, what the heck is going on with these bananas? Well, they were green, Julian, so I learned a trick that you can put this in the oven for like 10, 15 minutes at 350, and they get ripe and soft. It's pretty incredible. So the, we're gonna so use So you put these. it in the oven to ripen it faster? Yes, because they were green. They <laughs> so you turned it into that? Yep, so we're gonna smash that. Put that in there, mom. It makes them like soft and sweet, right? It makes them really soft, yeah. I thought you just left that one out for six months. No. Now, the riper the better, so it makes the banana cake sweeter. So how many bananas are you using? I, well, usually I use three, but I'm going to use four for this recipe because I like a lot of bananas in the, in the cake. Wow. Mm. And how much do you mash it up? Oh, I mash it a lot. You just want to make sure it's all mashed in. You don't want little chunks in there. Is the fork easier? Yes. Yes, yeah, better. So we have two and a quarter cups of all-purpose flour. Here I have a teaspoon and a half of bacon powder, a teaspoon of bacon soda, and a, a quarter teaspoon of salt. I'm adding a cup of raw sugar. So we're going to add that banana mixture. So I'm adding half a cup of softened butter. Now this is three quarter cups of buttermilk. If you don't have buttermilk, you can make sour milk by adding a tablespoon of vinegar, white vinegar, and then fill it up to three quarters cup of milk and it'll make sour milk for you, okay? About a teaspoon of vanilla. Okay, now we'll mix it. Now I'm going to add two eggs, but I'm going to add one at a time. Mix it gently. Go ahead. So Jillian, we're adding a package of milk chocolate chips. I mean, you can add dark chocolate if you want, but I like the milk chocolate in this recipe. And I'm just throwing in those nuts. And just mix it and it's good to go. Okay? That's good, Mom. So I buttered the pan and I had a little bit of flour. And now we're pouring this in. So sometimes I add dates to this, Julian. Uh, no, no loves the dates in it, but I know you don't. So I won't in this recipe. I don't like the dates. I know, why? I don't get it. I don't like the texture it gives it, the skin from the dates. Yeah, but it melts, you don't. You ever have banana cake? Comment yeah. down below if you ever had it with dates and if you prefer it or not. It's very good. I definitely do not like it with uh, dates. You hey. stop me. This that is good. Good, good batter? <laughs> okay, so the rest of the nuts, Julian, I'm gonna add on top of the batter here. Well, it gives it that crispy crust. Yeah, yeah. It's good to roll anyway. <laughs> Okay, Julian, so it goes in at 350 for about 50 to 60 minutes. It's in the center of the oven. Okay. There we go. That's it. Please bake nicely. Nice. What's it supposed to be done? I think so. Okay. Let me just check it. Oh, yeah, it's done. It's done? What did yep. you just do there, Mom? You sure? Oh, I inserted a toothpick and it came out clean, so it's done. I hope it's good. <laughs> it smells amazing. I Doesn't know. It smell great. So I'll insert the toothpick and comes out clean. It means there's no batter on it. It means it's cooked. And that was one hour or? 55 minutes. When you like this, <laughs> however you want. It's your piece. 
Mmm. This is good. Yeah, I like it better with the dates. But... So good? No. But I like this. I don't like the skin of the date getting inside of it. The texture is better That's like skin. this. There's no skim. There's skim. It melts. This oh, is good. This is good. See? I like to dip this in coffee yeah. or milk. You know why I like it? Because it's just mm. right. It's not too sweet. It's moist I and love it's it. not overly sweet. Yeah. Nope. Oh my gosh. I give it a 10 out of 10. <laughs> Me too. How about you? It's Nine. good. Wow. Yeah, it's, no, it's good. Very, very good. If anybody tries this recipe, let us know down below in the comment section mm. how it turns out. This is one of the, my favorite cakes my mom makes. It's amazing. Very yeah. good. Thanks for watching. See you next time. See you next time. Bye. Ciao. Ciao.